Hi everyone, welcome to our channel, Rebecca, Stu, and the crew. I'm Rebecca, and today is Friday, which means it's time for our weekly What is New at the Dollar Tree for the week of December the 4th. So let's go shopping. First, we'll head over to Apparel and Accessories. They had restocked their t-shirts this week. It's the Gildan brand, and they had sizes all the way from 3X down to 6 months old. They had tons of styles and sizes and colors so make sure you check those out at your local dollar tree they just had stacks and stacks of these at all of the dollar trees that i went to they also had the child size multi-use scarves um, they had a bunch with a solid color some are more of like a pastel color and then the bright neon colors they had like an electric blue the really bright orange and the neon pink but then you could also get some with printed patterns on them as well they had the butterflies with some pastels, the cheetah print, and then um, some with little uh, like unicorns and rainbows and emoji desserts. They also had a red one with some different robots and things. The dinosaurs, of course, you can't leave them out. And then some rocket ships, um, sharks, and a few different ones that were sports geared. So they had a football uh, soccer ball, basketball, and baseball. So those are really nice. They're a decent size. I actually purchased two of these for my younger girls and they fit really well and they're age 12 and 13. They also had these necklaces in and a bunch of different bright colors. They restocked their earrings in those little boxes on the ends of the aisles and then they had some new eyeglass cases. So these are really pretty. They have a mandala style to them. They had really pretty soft colors, which I like those a lot. And there were four different ones that I found. They also restocked their men's socks with different characters and pictures on them. They had quite a few different ones. I just took a picture of a few to show you what was out there. So now we'll move over into the craft supplies and art kits. So this week they put out a lot of their last minute gift ideas. They had these new spiral art gift sets and the art scratchers with the rainbow background. I also found these really neat wood puzzles called Woodshop 3D Puzzles. They had a flamingo, two different dinosaurs, and a unicorn. And once they're put together, you can also paint them. And they had these new books with the watercolor on the front and they're just a one-sided picture so you don't bleed through. They had a new spin art kit and some air dry clay by the Crafter Square. You get 8.8 .8 ounces. They restocked their Maker's Twine. They had a bunch of different colors, a lot of pastel pinks, a couple different shades of pink, purple, green, and then orange in like a peach color. They had an 80 count bag of pom-poms in black and in white. Or you could also get these miniature pails and a bunch of different colors and different stripes. The 250 count pearls is a great buy for a dollar. And now we'll move over into the baby needs. So they had these new Paw Patrol baby washcloths. So you get three pink or blue. They also had their burp cloths back in from the baby of mine brand. But this week they had something new, which were the bibs to match. They have these really cute bibs. I love the material. It's so soft. They have um, yellow, the very soft baby green. You can get the pink and white stripes or the blue with the white stripes as well. Over in Health and Beauty, we'll start with cosmetics. They had a bunch of Wet n Wild products. They had the Wet n Wild Color Icon Blush, Bronzer. They had highlighter as well. And then a bunch of their lip paints. They had a bunch of different colors of those. I just took pictures of two. And then they had some new um, lip glosses and lipsticks that were called Lip Ones. They're the Mega Last. Um, I found three different colors of the Mega Last brand. Um, by Wet n Wild and then they had some other lip glosses that were in like a larger tube those were in the nude and then they had the ombre lip one so you get two different lip um, sticks in this package just on uh, each end there so that's a good buy for a dollar they also had their keep going lip stains it's a pump up um, lip gloss kind of like a lip liner and then they had eye wands as well so they're double-sided you get the dark black and the smoky gray or the dark brown with the um, bronze color they also had these miniature eyeshadow sticks there were four different colors and then they had the mega eyes 
defining liner. In the dark brown, they also had it in black, or you could get it in um, like a midnight purple. They had violet as well. So they were two different colors, but basically they were just purple. They also restocked their duo LA colors, eyeshadow and eyeshadow pencils. Their um, three color eyeshadow palettes. They had a bunch of colors of those. They also had the wet and wild brow mascara and the wet and wild lift brow lifter pencil. So I thought that was really neat for a dollar. They also had in their concealer sticks as well for the Wet n Wild brand. Then they had restocked their glow nail polish. You get three colors of these miniature nail polish and these gift box sets. There's tons of color options. And then the Sassy Chic brand put out a bunch of their glitter nail polish for the holiday season. And it has the extra large glitter with the clear polish behind it. I also found some Maybelline Color Show polish set done by Maybelline. That's a really good purchase when you get to nail polish for a dollar. Sassy Chic put out these makeup sponges. They're clear gel with the gold or the silver glitter. They also had their cosmetic brushes, the three pack restocked with a bunch of different designs and some new hair colors. They had three colors. You could get auburn, black, or blonde. They also had this new finishing spray called Under Control. I did purchase one. I do like it. And then they had the Aquanet Extra Firm Hold Hairspray. It's the four ounce bottles for a dollar. I like to use this on my girl's hair during gymnastics season. They also had the Scalp Tonic for Thicker Fuller Hair. It's for the scalp made with natural ingredients. Also, they restocked their L'Oreal Color Vibrancy Repair and Protecting Balm or the hair mask by John Frieda, vibrancy enhancing with boba oil, damaging repair mask with the vitamin E oil, and the blonde brightening mask with the grapeseed oil. Also, they restock the scrunchies with the rib pattern on them. These sell really quickly at our Dollar Tree. Every time they're out, they're gone. They restock these quite often. And I was happy to see that they brought back the last minute gift sets with the miniature bathtub and the bath bombs. There were the Spa Natural Aromatherapy Fizzies. You get four in a pack of those or some female-friendly bath bombs in two different sets. The Spa Life put out some new hydrating, soothing, cooling eye pads, or you can get the Last Minute Gift Sets Body Spray. There were two different ones. They had the Fahrenheit smelling one and one that's supposed to smell like Dracar Noor. Also, Ead put out these miniature gift sets. Each gift set has a shower gel and a miniature body spray or a cologne. So they're very similar to the ones they've had years past. They're just boxed a little bit differently this year and different style bottles. They had out the Super Call Instant Max Throat Relief Pain Drops, some women deodorant wipes. You get 25 wipes in a packet. And they also had the antibacterial wipes. They're twin packs and you get 30 wipes total. They also had out some eyeglass cleaning cloths, which matched the eyeglass cases I showed earlier in apparel and accessories. Over in home decor, there were some new fun finds there. They had these miniature banks that look like a shadow box that say saving for a race car, saving for a unicorn, treat fund with the gold frame, and then the silver glitter frame says coffee cash. Wall Creations put out a new sticker that says be beautiful. I thought that was really pretty. And then the last minute gift sets, they had the boxed calendars, which are the little wood uh, calendars here. They have this family makes this house a home, a cross, and then my personal favorite, which said blessed with the sunflower. They also had some box pictures. Uh, that you could hang they were geared mostly mostly towards like the laundry room and the bathroom and they had a farmhouse feel to those there were four different ones that you could purchase and they had these laser cut desk sets they're double-sided they look like a triangle there is a little led light inside and there were four different ones they had this blue one here with the coffee the pink one that says out of office and today will be awesome they also had a light green, which says chasing unicorns and pretending to work. Then the yellow one here that says daydreaming and dream big. I also found these um, shadow box looking picture frames. They're like a deep set picture with um, the words raised up off of the back there. They had coffee, laundry, welcome and blessed. But some of them were glued on pretty crooked to so make sure you check those before you buy them. They also found most of those on these little end caps like this one here. I found this new 
um, picture frame with the little attachment at the bottom to put in like a name or a year, which is really neat. Those were also in the last minute gift ideas. They had their little box uh, jewelry sets and some new mirrors. They had two of them with the black or the white frame. They also put these pictures back out. They had the kitchen one, um, the gray palette look that says, welcome to our home. And then they had um, one that said, welcome. It had the black frame around it with like some little fern uh, type pictures in the background. And my favorite, which was this one that says blessed. They also put out their dried floral bouquets. They only get, it seems like one box per store. From what I noticed, they went to five different Dollar Trees. They all had one box. Some of them were almost gone and some of them look like they had just been put out. But you can get them in the green, red, tan, and blue. They also put back out these little trinket trays that look like a beehive and the miniature jars. I found some new bath sets. They have the white and blue. They also had the white with the black, gray, or the solid white. And I only found the toothbrush holder and the lotion dispenser. Over in Home Office, Home Library, and Teaching Tree section, they put out their extra large dry erase expo markers. They had them in several different colors, but one for a dollar really isn't too bad of a buy if you're looking for those. And some magnetic calendars. They have the calendar at the top and a list pad at the bottom. They're magnetic and will hang like on the refrigerator or a file cabinet. They had a couple different ones, all for 2021. I found these four different pens geared towards children. They have six colors for each pen. You can get the Disney Princess, Minnie Mouse. They also have Jurassic World and the Tonka truck. Jot Brand put out these double-sided colored pencils. You get 12 colors in all. And they brought back these little miniature pencil tins. There's quite a few different ones. They're really colorful designed lids. And then the bottom of the tin is a solid color. They also put out these little plastic pencil boxes, which match the desk sets and things they put out last week. They also had a unicorn tape dispenser. Then they had a bunch of the Disney uh, leveled readers and a bunch of Nickelodeon type books. They had um, Mad Libs books with stickers. Um, some had some uh, like apps you could download to read the book with you. There was a whole bunch of different books. They had the PJ Mask um, leveled readers as well. So there was one book for each character to get the whole set there. So lots of great ideas for stocking stuffers and gifts for kids um, for Christmas to encourage learning, which I thought that was really neat that they put these books out for a dollar. You really can't pass it up. They're really expensive at other stores. So I thought that was a great buy. And now we'll move over into housewares, home maintenance, and organizations. They have the new wax melt scents. They had Tiki Colada and Turquoise Tides, Mineral Mist, and Healing Stone. Um, they had Melon Pop and Orange Cream Sickle, Rose Quartz Crystal, and Soothing Sandalwood. They also had their scented oils back in. The Flower Citrus is my favorite. And a bunch of their microfiber cleaning cloths. They had this new one called Scrub It. You get two and it has the gray coloring here and you could also get the scrubbing bubbles drop in. So now we're in kitchen and pantry. They had some trail mix packs. You get four packs in each one for a dollar. They also had the Peppa Pig's uh, little chocolate chip cookies and the Halloween themed cereals. They had the full size boxes of those and some pink Him Himalayan salt Um grinders that was nice they also brought back these soup bowls with the snap-on lids i actually use these i really like them a lot and definitely recommend them over in party supplies they just had a bunch of new dinner napkins and more of like a summer type color and they put out some more supplies to go with this theme of birthday um a theme here they put out a balloon and some like little blowers and things they also had some really pretty gift bags and that had an ombre look with a gold um, design on top of them. There were four different bags that I found that were new that were just gorgeous. And they also had these little shot glasses that say future misses. Over in pet care, the only thing new that I found this week were these four pack of pet toys. You could get them in the pink or in the blue. And now we'll move over into the seasonal items. 
really not a lot to show there. They did put out tons and tons of gift bags and boxes. I did find a lot of these bags were really pretty. I love the palette look to them. I think they would make great uh, backdrops for like pictures. You could frame these. They're so pretty. I really enjoyed those a lot. They also had these two pack of gift bags that had glitter on them. So this pack you get Merry Christmas with the red glitter and then the bag that came with it had these Christmas trees. You could also get the hollies with um, the Christmas ornaments in the silver and blue or the little red trucks and the bag that came with that had the silver snowflakes. They also had some extra large shirt boxes um, that were a really nice box. They had a bunch of those and then the gift boxes you get a three pack of those. They also had the Merry Christmas balloons in the red and green. You could get Merry and Christmas in either color and they put out these um, like cookie tins. They're kind of like a plate but a little bit thicker so they have like some depth to them so that you could put like cookies and things on them and wrap those up as gifts or just put them out for your holiday um, season. Then I found some new stockings which I thought were so cute. They had these white stockings with the pink unicorn. You could get the blue or the rainbow. I just thought those were absolutely adorable. I don't know why it took them so long to put those out. Over in Toys, Games, and Entertainment, they had these really cute little dentist and doctor sets. The dentist kit just cracked me up. It was so cute. They had this like giant toothbrush, some teeth that you could pull out, a fake mouth. It also had some tweezers and things to pull teeth with. I thought that was really cute. They also had the doctor set with things you would expect to see, like a stethoscope, a thermometer, and a syringe. And you could get them in two different colors. They had the pink and dark blue, or the green with the light blue. They also had these fun Play-Doh sets. It has a snap-on lid with cookie cutters in the top, and you could get them in four different colors of the modeling dose. So they had it in green, blue, red, and in yellow. They also had these Dig and Glow Crushed Treasures. So you just have to like chisel away. It's kind of uh, like looking for buried treasure and fossils. They also had some robotic arms, which seemed to be going really quickly. And they put out some more of these special box sets of the Hot Wheel cars. They had the Mock Speeder here. These are the ones that you can get an app to download and you can actually play with your car with the app. I'm not exactly sure how all of it works, but there was quite a few um, different ones. I've shown some other ones before. They had one that was like a spider, Batman, things like that at other Dollar Trees. For some reason, this one particular Dollar Tree had about six or seven different box sets of these specialized Hot Wheel cars. And they just had their traditional matchbox and Hot Wheel cars. Some of them had, um, you know, like movie themes to those. They also had some really fun ones like motorcycles, tow trucks. They had a speed boat and like a um, patrol boat type one and um, just a regular like pickup truck and the um, recycling truck. I just thought those are really neat. They even had a skateboarder here. They also put back out these extra large construction trucks. I thought these were really neat. They're pretty well built. They seem like a little bit more heavy duty than some of the other little cars and things that they put out. And there's quite a few different ones. I believe there is four or five different ones you could purchase. And then they had these little ponies, which were really cute. They come with a comb. You can get the gray one with the dark brown spots. They had a black one with gray spots and a light brown with the dark brown spots. And of course, the little rubber duckies, you can't forget them. They had four different glitter ducks. Um, I thought those were cute. And I really love these blockbuster puzzles. They're 500 piece. You get the Titanic, Back to the Future 2. They also had Footloose. Flash Dance and Clueless. So they're basically old movie themes. I thought that was a great idea. They had some new um, pails out in different colors. Their squishies are back in. And they had these large um, pets with a pet bowl. And it comes with a treat. So they had a couple different ones that were um, dogs. You know, they have the dog bowl. And then they put back out their Barbie pets. They come with a basket and a toy. They also had the Barbie sets, which were like the shoe pack. They had the handbag pack. You get four handbags. 
and then the headband pack with sunglasses. They also had some of their clothing back in. They had um, the gymnastics set, the swimming lifeguard set, and then just a few different um, Ken or Barbie clothes. It comes with shoes as well. Then they had the miniature pack sets like the spa kit, the cat, they had the dog, and then they had one that was like a taco bar, margarita type kit, and the office kit. And now we'll move over into the Dollar Tree Plus, which is a three to five dollar section. They had this Monster Dome Challenge um, game, the electric keyboard, a miniature karaoke set with sunglasses. Then they had some more of the Hearth and Home um, shaggy pillows. I found a couple different pillows. I believe four. They had the cheetah print and the buffalo plaid, which are really popular um, this Christmas. Um, I've seen a lot of those and then they had the um, Sherpa uh, throw blankets which are really nice and there's quite a few different colors designs and styles some are a little bit more um, smooth and some are a little bit more shaggy that is it for today's video thank you guys so much for watching don't forget to subscribe like and share and share here are some other videos from our channel you might also enjoy I hope you all have a great week and I'll see you next Friday